Sony FX30 is currently priced at $1799. How low can Sony push the price to give the Sony FX10 to compete in the market? We really think Sony should slow down the FX and ZV series and try to revive the old camcorder cinema cameras like Z90, FS7, NX80, etc. And Sony really needs to sort out its naming. Lately, all the camera models are coming up with random naming patterns, so users, rightfully so, get confused. Granted, price is the deciding factor to understand the position of the camera in the entire lineup, but come on Sony, make some effort to ease the process. The latest model, Sony ZV-E1, is also the first vlogging camera with a full-frame sensor borrowed from the A7S III, which shares the sensor with FX3. So it's a valid concern what series should you go for, ZV, FX, or A7S? The main factor that distinguishes the ZV series from the FX series 